Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. We're here today to react to uh, Red vs. Blue Zero, Episode 1. I just want to say a couple of things before we get started. Um, first of all being that uh, Red vs. Blue is something that's uh, it's very dear to me as a series. Uh, I did start watching it, I did start watching Red vs. Blue uh, when there were only a few episodes in way back in uh, 2003. I believe it was. I was still in... Uh, middle school when I uh, discovered them um, it was my first exposure to Rooster Teeth obviously um, and I've, I love the series I love the, the guys working on it originally and and what they built and ha how Rooster Teeth came to be this, this huge company with so much so many things that I, that I care about as, as like a fan of like animation and, and uh, let's plays and content creation and everything like that um so i i have some high hopes for this series or uh this season i should say um what well, one thing is to be is uh red vs blue it's it's never been all about the animation for me like the 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 great animation like after monty um uh joined and everything that that was always good and that was always like a, a nice like bonus that you got for watching this series but for me it's always been more about like the dialogue and the interaction and the relationships between the characters. So I'm really hoping that, uh, that it'll have like the same feeling to it, uh, in regards to the relationships between the characters and have the, have the same kind of dialogue with like both in comedic timing and in, in the, uh, like the emotional moments too. Cause there, there have been some wonderful emotional moments with this series, which is something you would never expect um, when you start the series off. Um, but there, there have been some times that, yeah, the, the series ha has has made me cry just with ha how it, how the things are said and how uh, how the characters like deal with each other and themselves and how they grow throughout throughout the entire experience. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get into this, uh, please make sure that, uh, before you watch this, you're going and watching the original content, um, either on Verve or on Rooster Teeth's website, um, support the, uh, creators of this because this, this is how this company came to be, is through this series, and it'd be, it'd be a shame if the, the creators of this didn't get their, uh, didn't get their, um, God, I can't think of the word. Uh, didn't get their credit for for making such something that brought has brought so many people together and and changed so many people around the world. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get into this. Switch to that. And this is gonna be the uh, the first uh, the first video recorded with this new um, with this new layout. I'm gonna be testing to see how how I like doing this and see uh, if anyone else likes this setup more than the uh, the actual like picture in picture alright three two one and I know that like the animation and everything is supposed to be like a major selling point of this season so I'm hoping it's not focused mainly on that and still has like like I said like the dialogue between the characters and their and their relationships like it'll be it's cool like it has really good animation but that's not mainly what I'm looking for Washington. One, rude, and two, heard they fixed that a long time ago using cutting edge robotics and old kitchen appliances. He's got superpowers now. Really? Like super strength or hearing? No, 
Something more practical, like knowing seconds before a microwave is set to beep. Is that really Washington? Oh, I didn't expect him to be the first one we see. Whoa, take it easy, pal. Orders are to safely transport this artifact, or whatever it is. Mm. He must be here with that transport. Probably added security for whatever's in there. So that can't be good. Why? I'm just saying, anyways. It's cold out here. <laughs> really dark. Afraid of the dark? Like, what are you, a child? Shh, I'm not afraid of the dark. That's just silly. I'm afraid of what can happen in the dark. Right. What's crawled up your butt? It's that transport. Whatever they brought here for safekeeping might be trouble. I'm getting bad vibes about it. Yeah, to make things more weird, I heard it's possibly alien. Alien? That sounds so dangerous. <laughs> what the? Come on, on your feet! All right, that was a decent transition. Stop right there! Don't even think about it. Send reinforcements. No! We need everyone. It's weird, like seeing this many people not in armor. But I guess that's what comes with like having the actual animation and not just doing like the machinima style uh like recording It sounds like Wash, but I can't quite tell if it's the exact same, like, person. Alright, I think I automatically like this character because they f fucking fight like Minato from Naruto. She is. Agent Carolina, what took you so long? A fan? You want an autograph or something? Thanks, Carolina. Let's do this. I'm glad to see Wash is like actually recovered. It, it's 
it's so weird to to see like just like a full episode of like actual animation and like none of the machinima stock it's such because it's like what you got for like 17 seasons of this And like, I'm so glad to see like that they're actually able to do this now. Yep, you're all crazy. I ain't trying to kill him. You pissed her off. off. Look whoa, out! Whoa. Fearless. <laughs> I almost puked him on the first day. That would have been embarrassing. Attention! At ease. All you had to do was pick up the rookie. Instead... Commander West, I'll take responsibility. Lock it up, Agent One. Drop and give me 50. Instead... AWOL, illegal racing, Damage to military property. I should have all your asses cleaning the latrines with your personal toothbrushes. For now, we got bigger problems. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's in my ear. Uh. Oh God, that's so gross. Ah, oh, man. God damn it! How are you gonna take Wash like that, dude? He just got better. Next time, freelancer. You have on the count of three to tell me what I want to know. Three. Does roughing up your prisoners usually work for you? Die. Oh. Where's the temple? Hey, that looks kind of scary. You're not gonna stick that in anything, right? Or up anything too <laughs> he knows he knows the alien artifacts are keys to the temples that hold the ultimate power shut it you big goon if he's not going to tell us this will who even are you i'm not the one to be played with you let us with a one number to get you when you got the rep to get deputy to start running off ah how are you going to do that to wash in the first episode I hope this doesn't, this music doesn't like get fucking copyrighted. Commander, we have the coordinates. I want to see like any of the voices you haven't even seen the best part to get in the game join up and press start let's see Yeah, it looks like the same people. Um, yeah, that was that was a pretty good start. Um, I this it is a little bit more of a serious tone starting off. Um, I'm 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 interested to see where it's gonna go. And uh, like I said, it's it's just so. Uh, let me go ahead and switch that. It's just so uh, odd. Like seeing like uh, an actually like fully animated uh, 
a fully animated uh, episode of this without any like of the machinima elements at all. Um, no, I, I can see like a little a little bit of the dialogue is still there and a little bit of the the humor from uh, from the series uh, coming from before. Um, I wonder how that's going to develop for us. We obviously have our our new uh, our new group, uh, significantly smaller than uh, than what we had before, with what like ten people or something like that. Now it seems like we're we're going down to three or three or four, and then maybe like Carolina and maybe Wash. Uh, I hope I hope that we still get Wash. Uh, after whatever they're they're done with doing whatever to him, it sucks that he he was like sidelined pretty much the whole time for uh, the last season, I believe, and then like having to come ha- get, getting like recovered, which I didn't think was gonna be a a plot point of this. Like I didn't think he was ever gonna recover from what he went through before, and then getting a. Uh, recovering and then getting like an actual like part in the opening to this and then immediately getting bodied um yeah it's it's usually to see we actually have like bad guys now like right off the bat we we see who they are cuz like in the in the old series boy you you would have to wait a, a few episodes into into a season to even see like who the bad guy was going to be um about their designs like i i never i've never got the chance to play like uh halo 5 so i i don't know what uh what like armor and and shit and that looks like really all that much um so i don't know if those armors are like based off of like actual halo armor um the designs uh i, I guess they look pretty good uh, but like I said, I was never one like all about the animation, but I guess I'm going to have to like be more into what the animation looks like because that looks like that's what they're going for with this with like actually like no machinima elements and all just their own animation and uh, what seems like their own designs. Um, I do like, uh, I didn't, I, I didn't really catch her name. The uh, one with the teleporting knife. Um, I'm a big fan of that uh, because it's just like a, uh, like I said, like Minato from uh, Naruto, who is my uh, favorite character in that uh, series. So uh, yeah, I like seeing her her do that stuff. Um, I don't know how uh, I feel about the big guy. I mean, I guess he looks cool. I did s- <laughs> the line uh, the line he said something about the temples holding like the ultimate powers. It seemed really cheesy and like really cliche. Um, I don't know. I guess it's an all right line though. Um, I don't know how I feel about the uh, the orange guy either. Didn't really get much out of him. I guess he's he's played off as like supposed to be like this like super cool in control bad guy. So uh, I want to see where they're gonna go with him. Um, yeah, I'm I'm I'm. I'm gonna give this a fair chance. I, I actually kind of enjoyed the, watch that watching that first episode. Um, I'm I'm trying to separate this now as much as I can from like the old series, despite there being like characters and stuff coming back. But um, yeah, I, I I can tell this is gonna be its own thing, and uh, I hope maybe we get to see the uh, the other characters at some point. But um, yeah, I'm I'm gonna try and judge this as like its own thing rather than being just like a direct continuation of the last series. Um, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please, uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I do have Patreon. Uh, it'll, the link for it will be down in the description below. Um, right now there's going to be a, uh, the series Cobra Kai and Mandalorian being put up on there in full length. Um, yeah, uh, please, uh, come back for the next video and I'll see you then. Have a good one.